interesting part of uh, software like 3D, uh, Cloud 3D is a wind effect. For example, you create a classes and pattern and you want to turn on the wind and see the wind effects here. Going here, as you can see, the wind icon is here. You can turn it on. And this is a wind icon. To access its settings, you have to click on it. As you can see, the wind effect is <clears throat> in this direction. Okay, you can change it anywhere that you want. If we select it, you can here activate the wind effect. For, uh, for it first, I create some uh, simple glasses here to uh, simulate the wind effects. Okay. As you can see, this arrow means the wind effect is in that direction. Uh, okay, you can uh, select the wind, bring it there, and rotate it to create a direct uh, wind direction here. Okay, its position is uh, the position of the wind like this. If the type is planner, I will explain it to type if it is planner it means uh, wind is going in this direction to hold this direction of the software so the position of the wind is not important in this type but the rotation is important okay the, the rotation in this direction is important because it changes the direction of the world the wind so uh, we have a class here we change the class for uh, staying in its position, as I said before, you can pin it. Pin box. Select it and click and drag to pin it. And if I hit simulate, we have to active the wind first. Sorry. Uh, going to select, select and active the wind. And here is the wind. It's so simple with the default setting. In the default setting, everything is nice and like a real world. But you can change its settings. Okay. So here you can change the direction of the wind in any direction that you want. For example, in this direction. You can, on a real time, change the wind direction. So if you select it, Ctrl C and Ctrl V, and create another, and go it in the back. As you can see, the back of the wind is not important because the direction of the <clears throat> board in a planner mode is infinite from infinite negative to infinite positive. So it's not important. But, but, but if you select the type spherical, okay, we have an spherical. Now, as you can see, because a spherical means we have a sphere that the wind goes in its all direction like a sphere. Okay, this is an spherical. So in a spherical, if you <coughs> uh, select it, uh, in a spherical, you cannot change the, uh, for example, diameter of the spherical. So, the position of it is important because wind is come from the center of that spherical. For example, if you bring it here, and as you can see, uh, this <clears throat> close that is closer to this part is to give more wind. And as you can see, the position of it is very important. For example, if you bring it here, as you can see, it's going in this direction and going in this direction. So if you want, you can use a spherical call or, okay, the best mode is planner. The position of it is not important, but the direction is important. Here you can change the strength if you want a little wind like this. You can change the strength or you want to stronger wind like a stormy, you can increase or decrease the strength of the wind. <clears throat> Decay is uh, something like damping. You can change the number and see the effects. But the most important thing is the turbulence. The turbulence make the uh, wind uh, effects like a real world. It's turbulence. It means if you set the turbulence on a zero, we have just a uh, 
simple wind with a uh, not turbulence it means if you change the turbulence to any number as you can see it changed the direction it changed the uh, strength of the wind it's make a turbulence the frequency means it's actually turn off turn on like a sine wave for example if you uh, give a number in a second for example two second it turned the wind on then turn it off turn it on turn it off turn it on it's like a frequency turn it off or on the wind but the default setting create a realistic wind that you want here is a transform you can change the position of x y z you can change it to 0, 0, 0, 0. it's going to the exactly center if you want as you can see the position of the planner is not important that's it. as you can see it does not change but the direction of it is important uh, okay this is a wind you can turn it off or on so it's here and you can deactivate it and Hello my friends, to continue these tutorials on YouTube, subscribe us, like us, and hit the bell icon. And now, you will be alerted about all of the amazing videos that we release.